Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Biology and we'll continue our discussion on uh, the kingdom fungi. Today specifically we're looking at the reproduction in what in fungi and of course we're going to look at it in detail today. Now reproduction in fungi is both by sexual and asexual means. We have looked at it before. Alright, it's not the first time we are hearing it all in this what in this class. Okay, so reproduction in fungi is both by what sexual and asexual what means. Alright, so the sexual mode of reproduction is referred to as the telomorph. The telomorph is the sexual means. It's the sexual mode of what of reproduction in what in the fungi. Okay, why what the asexual mode is called the anamorph. The asexual mode is called the anamorph. The sexual mode is called what the telomorph. Okay, now these two modes, okay, together are called what the holomorph. Holomorph. Okay, so the uh, uh, the telomorph is the fruiting body. Why? Why the anamorph is what is is mode like? It's mode like together the telomorph and the anamorph. It's called what they want, the holomorph. All right. So please take note of that. That the sexual mode of reproduction in fungi is what the telomorph. Okay. Why the asexual mode in what fungi is what is the anamorph. You must take note of this. And also you must know that this tutorial is brought to you by the only one and only O3 school jam app. It is all you need to succeed in your exam. It has all the past questions you will need for all subjects in one app. All right. And of course, some other wonderful features like the classroom feature where you can, of course, uh, practice what study lecture notes and take tests on them and also we also have what wonderful features like the question search feature where you can search for question by topic and all the questions that Jamba said under that topic will come out for you to answer also we have the UTME challenge is a challenge it's a mock exam that that is done on the app every Saturday till one week to the main jam exam so you compete with your mates you win amazing prizes you get used to how jam set their question and of course you are seeing your score every week so you are able to track your progress all right and some other wonderful features all right so please jump on the app immediately and what download it go to play store it has been displayed on your screen right now go to play store download the application and make sure what you activate activation at the time of shooting this video to activate that app is just three thousand naira. it will go up definitely so please focus on passing your exam at once you do not want to write jam twice if you think you want to write jam twice ask those people that have written two or three times you will know that what they make you have to make sacrifices for your Word for your exam, three thousand naira is too small. So do not be stingy to yourself, and do not be stingy because you have a future and you don't have time to work to waste. So please download that app, activate it. To activate, just click on activate on the app after downloading. At the top, you see buy activation key. All right, you can what use your ATM card to pay online. Automatically, your app will open for you, or you can choose to transfer to the OTD School app account, which is on the app. All right, once you have made your payment, just send the receipt. The receipt of payment. Okay, to zero nine. One two one five one five two four six. All right, once you send the receipt to this number on WhatsApp, you'll be attended to manually. The app will be acti activated for you manually. All right, so please, you can also use POS to work, make payments. Anybody can pay for you, your parents can pay for you. All you need is that word receipt. All right, so now. Please get the app and let us continue from where what we stop. We say reproduction in fungi is both by sexual and what and asexual what means. And we say the sexual mode, all right, is called what the telomorph, while the asexual mode is called the what the anamorph. And say together, both that is both the telomorph and anamorph together, we call them what the holomorph. Okay, so now. Vegetative reproduction in fungi, which you have seen also in the previous episode, uh, slightly, you have seen it slightly in the previous episode, we said this takes place by budding. Okay, where we say a new organism is formed from the bud of an existing organism. Okay, also by fission. Okay, asexual means it's also by fiction. Okay, when we say fission, like of some unicellular with fungi, like yeast, okay, they have what, they are just that are what, that are unicellular. You see that what, that one cell they have what, Undergoes nuclear word division, okay, and splits into what into two daughter word cells, okay. So these two daughter cells they now grow, and of course when they grow, you see that what they now what form what the population of what of cell, okay. So that is what fission, okay, fission in fungi, and they also have fragmentation. When I say what a living organism what breaks down into fragments, and each of the fragments is an individual fragment that is what allowed to what to thrive on its own, okay. That is fragmentation. So vegetative reproduction in fungi it takes place by budding by fission and by what and by fragmentation so now we also have asexual reproduction okay we say this place this takes place with the help of spores 
called conidia, called what? Zoospores or what? Sporangial spores. Okay. All right. So the production in what? In fungi is by means of what? Or spores. Okay. So this takes place with the help of what? Or spores called conidia. Zeus or zoospores or what sporangios what spores. Okay, now sexual reproduction occurs by what by ascospores, by basidiospores, ospores, even what zygospores. Zygospores. Okay, now we have talked. We have talked about what uh, classification of what of fungi were based on what spore formation. All right, we we'll talk about what the ascomacet the ascomacetes. All right, that is what uh, uh, the fungi were that produce what ankle spores. Okay, what the basidium the basidiomacetes that what uh, the, the the fungi that that what that forms what the what the basidiospores. I also have what the oospores that what the zygospores. Okay, so please you must take note of this. That sexual reproduction occurs by ascospores, by basidiospores, by oospores, by zygospores and and the likes. Now, the conventional mode of sexual reproduction is not always observed in the kingdom fungi. Okay, please take note of that. Also, please like this video. Make sure you like that video. Click on that like button right now. So, you're watching the video, click on it like this. Liking the video will make other students easily find this video. Okay, do not forget to subscribe also to this channel. Click on that red subscribe button if you have not done that before. Okay, if you have done that before, there's no need to, to click click on it. Okay, so subscription is free to this channel. So, anybody can come here and watch. So, you can share the links. You can send to your friends who are preparing for this exam and what let them what come and what and learn. All right, so. Now, we have seen that, well, that the conventional mode of sexual reproduction is not always observed in the kingdom of fungi. Now, for the conventional mode, what happens is that the spore, the spores and the initial hyphae, okay, only have one copy of each chromosome. Okay, the spore and the initial hyphae have one, one copy of each what chromosome. Now, when an haploid, an haploid mycelium, okay, when an haploid mycelium, right, meets another what haploid mycelium that it is compatible with, okay, so when they are compatible with the world, they will fuse together and then they will form a diploid what cell, okay, they form a diploid cell, but in some other fungi, okay, in some other fungi, when what those haploid mycelium meet another what haploid mycelium, you see that this mycelium, they do not fuse together, they will interact, with, but they will not fuse together first, initially, so they have to pass through a phase or a stage, we call what the decario phase, okay, after the after they pass through this decaryophase stage, they now what um, fuse together and then form what the what the diploid what cell. Okay, so that's why I was saying that what the conventional mode of sexual reproduction is not always observed in the kingdom fungi. In some, the fusion of two haploid hyphae does not result in the formation of a diploid cell. Okay, in such cases, there appears an intermediate stage called the decaryophase. This stage is followed by the formation of the diploid what cell. Okay, so this is for reproduction in fungi. This is the reproduction in fungi. Please download the application, start practicing today, and start preparing for examination, and I'll see you at the top. Thank you for watching.